Okay, so what we're looking at here is the newest addition to my Radio Shack, and I have actually purchased a Kiwi SDR software-defined radio setup, and I have assembled it and put it together with a spare antenna that I had laying around, and I now am the proud owner of the Strange Beacons W9SPY Kiwi SDR. And I'm going to do a little quick demonstration here to show you how um, some digital SSTV looks on this. Um, and by the way, I'll put a link to my SDR in the uh, video notes so that you can access this if you want to. So I'm going to go ahead and get a plug in here, a little cable, and the sound is going to go off. I'm going to mute the audio. And now what we're going to do is we're going to open up EasyPal for some digital SSTV. Wait till that program loads. And we will walk this over a little bit, close up our screen. I'm going to go ahead and load a waterfall pick. And the next thing we're going to do is come over here to the ICOM 7300 going to hit the transmit button. Got it tuned to 7178 kilohertz by the way which is uh, image area of the 40 meter band. So we'll hit transmit. Come over here and hit transmit. You can see what's coming on the screen here. And what's appearing on the screen over here. Digital SSTV. We'll go ahead and send our ID out to, even though I've got it in the waterfall there, W9SPY. And we'll turn off transmit on this side. So anyway, uh, that's showing off two things at once here. I'm actually giving you uh, a little tour of my new Kiwi SDR that I'm really proud of. It's pretty easy to set up. It has a little admin page. You can come in and I was able to, as you can see, upload this image here. Uh, custom image, Strange Beacons, Twitter feed, uh, YouTube channel, and my new groovy little amateur radio sign, which is, by the way, right over here. Turn that bad boy on. There it is. That was another Christmas gift that I gave to myself. And uh, again, uh, this is another part of it, the Kiwi SDR. Let's take a quick tour here. Let me just show you this setup that I've got. This is an old radio, uh, radio antenna that I had. It's an MFJ, and it's got a little tuning coil on here. It's not the best um, antenna, but I wanted to make use of it. But down here is the Kiwi SDR. And you put this together. It includes the uh, receiver itself, and underneath it is a little thing called BeagleBone Green, which is the computer that actually runs this. And this wire here is hooked up to the GPS antenna, which is right here. Little GPS antenna. Uh, got a counterpoise wire that's running off of the um, MFJ. And of course, the MFJ is um, using um, PL259 into an SMA connector here. So that is the new Kiwi SDR setup. And again, I'm just sort of showing off here. Um, by the way, I'm holding this little GoPro camera. It was another, it was a second, third gift to myself. I've actually been pretty good to myself on Christmas. So um, that's this. This is me just showing off a little bit. Anyway, let's send one more image. This is pretty cool stuff. I really dig. Um, I really dig SSTV. Oh, hit the wrong thing. Okay, so let's uh, let's move this over a little bit, and we will load a waterfall pick. We'll come over here and we'll hit the transmit button. Transmit on the computer. There, it starts to move on my screen on here. And we'll come over here and we'll check it out on the big screen. W9SPY Digital SSTV on your waterfall.
and we'll do the right thing. We'll send our identification on here. W9SPY. Back over. Turn off the transmitter and we are good to go. Anyway, there's Christmas for the W9SPY Radio Shack. Thanks for watching.